How much of your life revolves around the internet? Are you one of those people who need it only for social media and entertainment? Or your entire work depends on it? With two-thirds of the world's population on the internet, it is an integral part of our lives and it's hard to imagine the world without it. So is it possible to turn off the entire internet? Is there an internet kill switch? Well, stay tuned to find out. Hey everyone, this is Tower Science, simplified science to make you smarter. The internet began as an effort to connect computer networks situated over broad areas. When you need to connect to computers, you can either link them physically or wirelessly. But a direct connection is cumbersome. If you want to attach just 6 computers, you need 15 wires and 5 plugs per computer. And it keeps on increasing with the number of computers. To solve this, all the computers are connected to a tiny computer called a router. Its job is to transfer information from one computer to another accurately. Once you install a router, you require only 6 wires for 6 computers. But what if you want to connect millions and billions of computers? In that case, you have to connect computers to routers and then routers with each other. That way you can scale infinitely. Since it is not possible for individuals to manually build a worldwide system of computers, ISP or internet service providers are required. An ISP is a company that manages special routers that are connected to individual computers as well as other ISPs. This is how internet works. Internet is a vastly complex network operated by a mixture of government and private companies. There is no single point from where all data flows. Think of the internet like rivers in the world. Stopping internet is like stopping all rivers at once, which is not possible. Yes, you can build dams or divert the flow of a few rivers temporarily, but water always finds another way. Internet was designed in such a way that data can find an alternate route if one part of the network is not working. Despite all that, there are still vulnerabilities in the web. In 2019 alone, there were 200 internet shutdowns in 33 countries. Government in several nations can order ISPs to block internet access. Since most people depend on these companies, this means no access to the internet. So theoretically, if all ISPs are united and government orders the giants like Google, Microsoft and Facebook to turn off their network, the internet is as good as dead. There are concepts in place to build a single point of control to turn off the internet in case of an emergency or cyber warfare, though many groups have severely criticized this idea. So what do you think about an internet kill switch? Let me know in the comments below. Hit the subscribe button if you like this video. Let me know in the comments what topics do you want to see next. And as always, keep learning, keep exploring until you know everything.